and my cat is just through there. She might come round here, she might not. We'll see. Cat came over, but she said exactly where I was gonna put my phone up. So I'm gonna have to find somewhere else to prop it up, but. The kitty's joined me, yay! So it's, what's the date? Friday the 16th. 16th, thank you. Oh, yes. Ellie. Where are you? Are you there? <laughs> you there? No, don't. <laughs> <laughs> and what's, what's the time, sorry? 10 past 10. 10 past 10, it's 10 past 10. Um, and we just arrived at Chligui. The beach is down there. Sorry. With the boats. Um, yeah. No, taking a video. <sighs> um Yeah, I think we're gonna get baps and go for a walk. What bath are you getting? Sausage. Sausage and egg. Maybe sausage and egg, yeah. They do good egg here. Yeah. It's runny. It's and like really but cooked. cooked. Oh. Yeah, they do really good baps. If you live in Wales, you gotta come to Cligway. It's brilliant. Um Yeah, so I think we're gonna it is, it's hot today. I shouldn't be, wear, I shouldn't be wearing my party. No. I've got a short seat t shirt on. Yeah. Um, it is very hot today. Here comes Belle. There's Belle. Don't do that. You've got to okay. eat her finger. <laughs> um, yeah. But there's like loads of, I don't know if you can see. Over there somewhere. Go. Over there. There's like six, four. One, two, three, four, five. Six, six boats all lined oh, up um yeah so um i don't know how long we're actually going to be here we're going to be here for a couple hey, hours we're going to be here for a couple hours so i don't know if i'm going to get any writing for dial it done hopefully i will when we get home um is that one with a bunch of siblings yeah that's the one i posted snippets from in the chat yesterday in writing group. yeah I, I thought it was yeah um uh, but on the way here and on the way back I'm reading Warstorm because I just need to gut down and read it. Um, so I'm on chapter 16. I want to get to chapter 19 before we leave so that I can read the second half. I think chapter 19 is halfway and then I can read the second half on the way home which would be nice. So yeah, just tons of beach, seas all the way out. Um, yeah, so we quite often walk down there. Sausage and egg, please. 
and then kind of come around and then make our way back up here and go to the car. But yeah, we're gonna get some baps. <laughs> we're at the beach we've eaten all the stuff we've eaten no, not all the stuff we've eaten the pots are all in there we just got the remainder auntie helen came and dropped off vinto because we ran out of smoothie and abby's camera hey. yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's so hot Abby's reading the air. I'm reading Secret Hen House Theatre. The air. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Please don't think we've eaten an entire bag of six, a multi pack of six prawn, crack prawn cocktail skips. <laughs> we've only eaten two so far. We might eat more. We probably won't. Is it good? Not <laughs> so, yeah. Yay. Picnic. We got ice creams. Mm -hmm. Ice cream! Camp. Camp Nanarimo. Did not go well. I thought it was gonna go. <laughs> I had this plan. I was gonna start and finish my book during July. I didn't even get halfway. Oh, it was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be and I think that's plainly because I didn't know much about these characters, I didn't know, I knew enough but I didn't know what their, how I was going to write them. Um, so the first like couple chapters they both narrated, I just kind of let them kind of show me what they were like and how their writing style was going to be. Um, and then I got the hang of it, and it was doing great. I wrote 5,000 words in two days. Um, and then I hit this part in the story, and I hadn't realised, and I didn't outline this part well enough. And so I got to this part in the book, and I was just like, where, how? I backed myself into a corner, how am I going to get out? This was at the end of week two. And so week three and four, I decided, you know what? We're gonna outline. We're gonna do in-depth outlining for just the rest of the book. And so I did. I have just a last little bit of outlining to do, um, like the last quarter of the book. So yeah, Dahlia and Ashley's story is coming. I'm hoping that I can get some more work done on it over the summer you know and it didn't help as well that it got very hot like really hot so i didn't want to sit inside on the laptop all day i wanted to sit outside with a book so i got a lot more reading done than i thought i was gonna uh yeah ashley and dahlia i didn't realize were gonna be very very different to write um i thought they were going to be very similar dahlia is kind of like a country girl and ashley is a princess so that kind of aspect is very different um, but like Dahlia's got this huge family and Ashley's got one brother and her parents and her grandparents so that was very different and I didn't plan on having Dahlia and her twin brother Drake they have a big fight and a falling out um, and I'll, there's a massive massive chunk of the book where they're just not talking 
and Ashley's kind of torn between she's friends with them both but who they're like you've got to pick a side you've got to pick one of us it can't be both but you know um so that was really interesting to kind of write and outline and the yeah the ending I'm really I haven't written, outlined it yet I know how it's gonna end it was really fun but yeah I got some time lapses some videos from the past two weeks that I will now I'm gonna show you um but yeah how did your camp go let me know did you reach your goals did you get your goals did you write a book did you work on something else let me know and see you guys next time. Bye.